Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I'll show you how to set up an integration to transfer new contacts from Zoho Inventory to Kajabi. This is necessary in order to automatically transfer new contacts from Zoho Inventory to other systems. For example, in Kajabi you can add new contacts and interact with them in every possible way in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next, you need to select the Zoho Inventory Data Source System. Now you need to choose an action. In this case, I want to receive new contacts. At this point you need to connect your Zoho Inventory account to the Apex Drive system. In this window, we need to specify the login and password of the Zoho Inventory personal account. Next, you need to grant permission to Apex Drive to work with your Zoho Inventory account. When the connected login is displayed in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. No additional settings are provided for the Zoho Inventory system, so just click Continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. Now you see the data for one of your Zoho Inventory contacts, if everything suits you, click Continue. This completes the setup of the Zoho Inventory data source successfully. Now you need to go to the data destination settings. We choose the system Kajabi. Next, you need to select an action. Send data. At this stage you need to connect your Kajabi account to the Apex Drive system. In this window, you must specify the URL for receiving data. In order to get it, go to your personal account Kajabi. Then go to the Sales Offers section, select the required offer. Next, we move on to additional settings. Select the webhooks item. Copy the activation URL and paste it into the corresponding field in the Apex Drive system. When the required field is filled, click Continue. When the connected login is displayed in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. At this stage, you need to select the type of data to be sent. Choose Post. Now you need to write the names of the variables and their values. In the Name field, enter the name of the variable that will be passed to Kajabi. In the value field, select a variable from Zoho Inventory that will correspond to this value. In order for another set of parameters to appear, click Add. When all the necessary variables and their values are specified, click Continue. At this point, you see an example of the data that will be sent to Kajabi via webhook for each new contact from Zoho Inventory. If something does not suit you, click Edit and you will go back one step. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Kajabi. After successful submission, go to Kajabi and check the result. If everything suits you, return to the Apex Drive service and continue setting up. This completes the Kajabi data reception setup successfully. Now you need to enable auto-update and select the update interval, for example once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck!